that's the correct way to say it. So um, yes, whenever I travel around Egypt and I tell people I'm from Norweg, Holland, Holland. <laughs> that's the uh, so finally people in Egypt know where Norway is. Um, he's he's a you know such a huge star. It's a, and he only just now turned 23. Uh, he's younger than my children, and it's just amazing. I think he has a, you know, such an extreme talent. And I also think he's extremely, you know, he's very sympathetic. Um, I think he's, he's not one of those, um, I don't know, flashing, rich, uh, you know, with, uh, I'm sure he has, I'm sure he has enough money, but he's really down to earth. He has, his parents raised him well, I think. He's, he's a very sympathetic young man, which I think is also great because he's like, a world star and he's yes uh, here in egypt uh, anyone make a comparison between salah and uh, uh, how long? yeah of course of course and i think you know that's one thing they have in common because mo salah is also such a world star but he's also you know really a sympathetic man he has really strong values and i think that's uh, you know uh, a lot of football players around the world could could learn something of, from him. Yeah. Uh, a lot of girls I talked uh, to, to them yesterday, uh, they said to me they want to be like Musala. Mm. Um, are it the same in uh, Norway? Um, girls uh, want to be like Holland? But yes, we have some really, really good fo women football players in Norway, like Alda Hegerberg, mm -hmm. uh, who is like ranked as one of the top players in the world. Um, and I'm really happy to see that you also have from Brazil, for instance, from several countries, the US, you have like also women players now becoming stars, mm -hmm. uh, which I think is, is a very good development because these girls need their own role models that look like yeah. themselves, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay.